Hey Chanel, how are you? This is TJ. Just going to do a very, very quick training on how to go into the Find Cash Buyers Now system and uh, search for these buyers who have purchased real estate in the particular area I'm asking you to go into within the past six months. So as you see right here, this is FindCashBuyersNow.com. That is the actual URL of the system. I sent uh, sent you the actual URL, the login, as well as the password a little earlier today. So moving right along, let's go ahead and sign in. Sign in with the same login information that you already have. And as you see, the system is very similar to the Find Motivated Sellers Now uh, system. Uh, gives you uh, a couple choices here as far as criteria goes when you're looking to search in particular areas. Uh, so you can either search by the county, by the city, or by the zip. Um, let's take Georgia Cobb County, the county you actually want to pull the leads for me in the Find Motivated Sellers Now. So let's go ahead and pull all of the cash buyers that have bought properties within the past six months. And what we want to do, we want to reach out to these guys and see if they're interested in purchasing any more investment properties at this particular time. If so, then we may have something in our inventory uh, that may fit their interest. So let's go ahead and click on GA, which is Georgia. If you scroll right over GA, you see it sp spells it out in text as well down below. So we want to click on that. And then we want to go ahead to the right, to the right of that, and click on Cobb. Okay, that is the county that we want to search for. And as you see, it already has it dated back. Uh, this is actually within the past 120 days. So what we want to do, we want to go back as far as six months. So we have four December, okay, November. October. All right. And let's go back to October 28th. Okay. Now we want to click on advanced search. Once we are dated from six months back prior to today's date, whatever today's date that you are running your search on, you want to go back six months from that date. So um, you want to leave this blank right here where my cursor is pretty much circling this area. Leave that blank and you want to come down to here where it says number of properties purchased, one through how many ever any. You want to leave that like that and then it has a sales price here that says zero uh, to one million. We want to modify that down to a hundred and fifty thousand. Okay, we we'll want to see how many cash buyers have spent one hundred and fifty thousand within the past six months in Cobb County, located in the state of Georgia. Now we want to unclick commercial because remember we don't we don't buy anything commercial and we don't sell anything commercial, so we're not looking for any people to buy anything commercial from us. So we want to unclick that and we want to leave residential clicked. Okay, so leave residential clicked. And what we're going to do is just come down here and hit search, depending on your network uh, and the speed of your internet will determine how fast you get the results back. So it may take a minute or so, depending on what network you're using. Still gathering data. <clears throat> and as you see, our results came back 711 results. So we have 711 potential buyers that have bought properties within the past six months in Cobb County, Georgia. This is actually in, in Atlanta. Okay. Now, what you want to do is, as you can see in the Fine Cash Buyers Now system, it has the buyer's name. Okay, as well as the property address that he purchased 
And this is his mailing address, more than likely where he receives all of his mail, okay? All right, so the property address is the property that he's purchased. And up above right here, this is actually a unique feature that this system provides. It has a telephone number of the actual buyer. Now, some of these numbers are current and some of them, some of them are not. But if you scroll down, you keep seeing... Uh, all of these buyers that have telephone numbers. Now, uh, one thing that we do do in the Find Motivated Cash Sellers Now or Find Motivated Sellers Now system, I'm sorry, is we don't want to go after the ones that have the same property addresses as far as the mailing address. Okay? And this is um, not true in this particular case right here. Okay? So, even though the property address is the same as the buyer address, we still want to go ahead and give them a call because they may be interested in buying more properties. All right. So, as you see, all these names have numbers. And what you want to do is you want to click all of the ones that have numbers on them, telephone numbers. Okay. Even LLCs, if an LLC or an incorporation has a telephone number, go ahead and click that as well because those are corporations we might be able to make a good contact with and see if they would possibly be interested in exploring what we have in our inventory. Okay, so here's an LLC right here. Here's a perfect example. All right, so we want to pretty much click on any and everything that has a number on it okay we want to go down one by one so remember as you're doing the define motivated sellers now system you're, you're kind of following the same uh, directions or route uh, that you would in that particular system with the fine cash buyers now as far as going through them in detail one by one to see if they have a number and if they do you want to click if they don't, then that's okay. All right. We want to click all the ones that have numbers. All right. And we want to export them. Now, for the ones that don't have numbers, what we're going to eventually do is we are going to put these in another uh, Excel sheet. We're going to export these in a whole nother Excel sheet. Okay. And we're going to mail these particular buyers a postcard marketing our services to them, letting them know that, hey, we do have inventory uh, in this particular area. We've seen that you purchased a property and paid for it in cash uh, a couple months back, seeing if you're still interested or in the uh, neighborhood of still buying any more investments at this time. Okay. So this is what the training is going to be about tomorrow morning as well, 9.45 a.m. This is why I wanted to meet with you on Skype. So uh, I just wanted to give you a short, quick training video. Now, as you would go ahead and export the leads in the Fine Motivated Sellers Now system, you're going to do the exact same in the Fine Cash Buyers Now. So now that you actually have all the ones clicked, and of course I don't, I'm just giving you a general idea, and of course you, you should have it uh all down by now because you've been working out of the fine motivated sellers now system what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and export all the all of the ones that you have clicked okay so you hit export to Excel and of course you want to hit export selection 10 because that's how many we selected right okay so we want to go ahead and export those alright so we just exported that into Excel and let's pull the Excel sheet up. And here's our Excel sheet. Okay. And this is actually a, a program uh, in Mac, in my Mac computer. It's um, called Numbers. It's similar to Excel, but it, it's somewhat different. So this is not uh, Word. This is not uh, properties of Word right here. So um, it may look a little different from your system. Okay, but you either way you want to go ahead and export that to Excel and uh, my bad I just actually clicked up out of there so let, let me get back in there really quick ok 
okay and we're going to well we necessarily don't have to go through that Chanel just remember that if there's two pages of how many ever buyers that we need to get make sure that you click through each page and scroll down one by one uh, for the ones that we are trying to attain okay and put those in the right Excel sheet all the numbers go on one Excel spreadsheet for that particular county of buyers and all of the ones without a number goes on another Excel spreadsheet so that way we can send them out mailers okay so uh, if you have any questions regarding this video, when we meet tomorrow morning, feel free to ask me. Until then, have a great evening. Bye-bye.